Hello boy, Dan 2K here when it came to the top 5 best tyres of 2017. So without further ado, let's get right into the news! So at number 5, we've got the Predator tyre from Eclat BMX. It's Bruno Hoffman's signature tyre. It comes in 2.3 wide or 58 millimeters. It pumps up to 120 psi and it weighs in at 735 grams. You can get this in the black desert tan with a black sidewall or dark gum with a black sidewall. The colors on these tires are actually really, really good. They hold their colorness all the time. So I don't even know what that means myself, but that's what it says on here. So I'm going to say it holds the colorness really good. The tread is actually really aggressive compared to other street tires. Tread goes all the way up to the sides, which is really, really good if you want to turn or stuff like that. Uh, if you do ride around in really bit dusty conditions, these are really good because the tread just will just filter out all that and it's just top notch. So number four, we've got the E-Clat Fireball Tire. It's Stevie Churchill's signature tire. This is nearly the same sort of design as the Predator Tire, but with a bit less tread on it, and it's a bit less aggressive on the sides too. It comes in 2.3 or 2.4 wide, if you're lucky enough to fit a 2.4 on your bike, as I'm not. It comes in black, army green, or black sidewalls. This is a pro-level street tire, the same as the other one. They're using this new thing called the Street Shield, a sidewall technology making it incredibly resistant to damage occurring grinding. So if you are up to grinds, this is completely 10 out of 10 for you since you won't pop your tire or burst into that tube which will ruin your whole day. And you can get them in the 2.4 size which seems to be a new thing going with BMX bikes these days. So I don't know why you would go to a 2.3 but you can go straight to a 2.4 if your bike will fit that. It comes in at like $32.99, same as the other one on Dan's comp. So at number three, we've got an S&M Speedball tire. It either comes in a big width or a small width. You'll know what I'm talking about in a second. It either comes in a 2.1 or a 2.4. There's no in between. That's the only ones they come in. They're basically all the same specs. In a 2.1, it's 1.25 pounds. And in the 2.4, it's 1.65 pounds. You can get them in gum or gum. There's not much choice. If you like gum, you have to buy these. They come in at roughly $30.00. They're a great tire if you want to go grinds because the sidewall is relatively thick. So on the, the tread on these tires are less aggressive than all the other ones, all the other E-Clat tires. It's very shallow and there's not there's no tread on the side of the tire. Well, if there, there is, but it's very minimal. It's primarily a street tire, but there is tread, but they, it'll just it'll just do the job if it does if it is a bit dirty. But um, I wouldn't suggest riding these on a dirty sort of uh, street. Something that s and do tell you, which all the other sides don't tell you, is the inflated width. Because it does expand more than the 2.1. So, 
if you're wondering why your tire is getting bigger in your forks that's probably why the 2.1's inflated width goes to 2.24 and the 2.4 inflated width goes up to 2.5 which is just absolutely massive so if you do want a big tire and spend like only 30 bucks this is the one for you warning Kush aliens are invading Earth. So at number two, we got a Colt D Heart tire. It comes in at 2.20, 2.35, or 2.40, which is the slick. It's completely different than the other tires. There's so many more options. You can get it in all black, gum with a black sidewall, dark gum with a black sidewall, white with a black sidewall, red with a black sidewall, purple with a black sidewall, and if you guessed it, grey with a side a black sidewall. Shit, I missed messed the last one up. This is a really, really fast rolling tire because of the tread on it since it's pointed one way. It's directional, so you can't have it around the other way. And they, and they grip like, Jesus on ice skates. That's how good they grip. And each size, if you get a 2.20, the tread is going to be completely different from the 2.20 to 2.35 and the 2.4, which is sort of good and bad at the same time because if you do want the slick tire of the 2.40, you're gonna have to like get new forks like a new frame just to fit a 2.4 if you're running a slightly older style frame they come in at $27.99 it is Chase Dehart's tire which is he's a great rider and if you are looking for some really nice unique different tread tires these are the ones to go for So number one, it's undoubtedly one of my favourite tyres in the whole world. It's the Van Colt tyre in 20 inches. It's um, all over tread pattern is based off a classic Van's waffle pattern. It's grippy in like nearly every single situation. The rubber they use is great. It's got high pressure sidewalls so you won't break it when you're grinding. It's lightweight. It comes in 2.20 or 2.35. You can get it in all black with a gum with black sidewalls, a white with black sidewalls, which this is what I'm about to say now is just like completely different and you'll probably blow your mind. In black with some 3M reflective checkered sidewalls, which is like, mm. or you can get gum in 3M reflective sidewalls if you do want to stay safe at night. You can get gum with a red strip and white sidewalls, which is these are completely, the last three are like completely different than all the other tires you can get. Which is, um, I don't know, it might, might be different, it might look good, but I think it looks like crap. So, um, if you do want to cop yourself some of these tyres, you can get it for $27.99 on the Vans website. And Dakota Roach, all those guys ride this tyre and they're pretty good for wall rides. Oh yeah, these tyres are good for wall rides too. They stick fabulously on the walls. So, um, if you do spend more time vertically than um, on the ground, uh, these are the ones for you. Sold up. All these rap suckers 
ain't nothing but some cold cuts. Lay your ass out on your back with your nose up. Niggas talking reckless, I'll fuck your whole show up. Bitches walking around, don't look down, bitch, you know us. Let this song cry down my face, bitch, I'm home. So thanks everybody, don't forget to like, favorite, and subscribe, and then enter my giveaway, click it right here, and it'll send you right to the giveaway. And um, I'm done with this video, and the cut bluey! Haha, <laughs> what a shitty outro that was.